Hi there and welcome to the Science Report. Today I want to talk to you about the work done by scientists at the Case Western Reserve University in the United States. They have developed or found a drug that seems to be speed up the rate at which certain tissues can regenerate on their own in the body. Now this product they made acts like a vitamin for tissue stem cells, stimulating their ability to repair tissues more quickly. Now the work has been published in the journal Science, so as usual I'll link you to the article or research paper in the description below. Now the drug they found is called SW033291, kind of a mouthful, and its general function is to increase the concentration of another chemical in the body called PGE2. Now it's this chemical, PGE2, that actually does the benefit of regenerating tissue. So the drug has been tested on three main tissues in mice. We have the colon, liver, and bone marrow. It's said that the drug rapidly repaired these structures with no adverse effects. They are quoted as saying, the drug heals damage in multiple tissues, which suggests to us that it may have applications in treating many different diseases. Now the drug has not been tested on people just yet, but the team are now working on developing it for human use and within the next three years or so. So mice given the SW033291 drug uh, recovered normal blood counts after a bone marrow transplant six days faster than mice that did not receive the treatment. Further than that, the drug almost completely healed mice with ulcers in their colon and helped mice that had parts of their liver removed regrow the tissue nearly twice as fast as the control group they used. Now what's probably most impressive is that the team tested out the drug on mice that had received lethal doses of radiation before being given a partial bone marrow transplant. Only the animals that were given the, the SW033211, whatever they called it, survived the procedure. So if you want to get a bit more as to what their drug actually does, the SW033291 drug, it decreases the amount of another chemical in the body called 15-PGDH. Now it's this chemical, this is the one that is inhibiting or decreasing the amount of the PGE2 in the body. Now that's the one that actually causes a quicker or better regeneration or healing of certain damaged tissues. Now because the drug they made, the SW1, is actually decreasing the 15 PGDH, which is in turn decreasing the other one, the beneficial one, it's essentially increasing the overall PGE2 drug in the body, or the chemical the, um, concentration of it. Kind of hard to understand, but basically their drug increases PGE2 in the body, which it acts as a regulator for stem cell proliferation. So that has been the science report for the week. I'm interested in knowing what you think about this sort of development. Uh, and of course, as always, I hope you're having a fantastic day.